numpy basics with you so as you can see this is the definition of numpy okay so what is the numpy numpy stands for numerical python and it is a powerful open source library in python for numerical and mathematical operations okay so what it does it makes the numerical and mathematical operations easy for you and also it provides a support for large multidimensional arrays and matrices along with a collection of mathematical functions to operate on these arrays okay so what numpy applies on which data type arrays particularly okay so the arrays can be one dimensional two dimensional or three dimensional now let's see some examples how we can use the numpy first of all we have to import the numpy using the import line okay import numpy as np okay so first let's run this okay so as you can see numpy as uh, numpy is imported as np okay now we can use numpy in our what in our programs okay so let's add some code cells now let's create some list okay so list can be created as just with the square brackets and it consists uh, basically list is a container data type okay and it consists of homogeneous data like integers floats strings etc so as you can see this is a list okay so if i print the type of li so it is actually a list okay so it is a class list and if i want it to convert an np array okay so what i am telling is np array so let's add a markdown so now what i will do is i will convert this list to an np array so how we can do just uh, 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 first of all uh, we name the np array as x okay so x will contain the np array and now i will use np dot array function to convert the list into an np array so let's run this cell and yes it is run now let's print of x so as you can see it consists of 1 2 3 and 4 now as you can see there is no such a particular difference between this uh, print of x statement and print of li statement but but here print type of li li gives class list now what if i write a quote line print type of x now you will see it will become a class of numpy nd array okay okay now let's some uh, let's get some another things which i will like to share with you okay so type function done we will see some another functions that are available in numpy one of which it is if i write print of x dot n dimension n dimension will give the dimension of the array so here array consists of only 1 2 3 4 as you can see it is a one dimension array so the answer is 1 now if for uh, by chance if x uh, let's take another example why uh, it consists of 2d array so how we create 2d array so in if we give two brackets so this is the initialization of a 2d array okay now how will add elements let's uh, let's suppose i want to create an uh, 2 cross 2 matrix okay 2 cross 2 matrix what is actually a 2d array so how we can create it so i will write 1 comma 2 and another i will write 3 comma 4 so now it is actually a list of list okay at present it is not what i will say not an np array okay so if i write print of type of y 
you can see in the output it will give class of list okay so how we will convert it to an array mpi so we will use y is equal to np dot array and i will pass it y so here y this y contains this list of list okay and then i will again write the same print type of y so as you can see for uh, for this particular line print type of y it was giving list now it is giving numpy of nd array so this list of list is converted to a 2d two dimensional np array okay so if i will write now print follow closely print y dot n dimension it will give the output 2 okay so what functions we have seen we have seen type function type function and there is n dimension function okay n dimension function there is another uh, what i can say another functions that we can explore in numpy array so let's suppose if i write print of y dot shape so what we will give so it will give 2 cross 2 okay so it will give 2 comma 2 or 2 cross 2 uh, why 2 cross 2 because it is a 2 dimensional array and it consists of 2 columns 1 comma 2 and 3 comma 4 okay uh, let's do one thing let's print the what matrix so it will become more clear so as you can see there are two rows and two columns so the shape is 2 comma 2 so we have seen another function that is let's uh, keep this in a markdown so what functions we have seen we have seen type function n dimension function and shape function another another function that exists in numpy that we can explore is if we write print y dot size so size will just give the number of elements in uh, present in the array y so how many elements so 1 2 3 4 so 4 elements so just it will give the output 4 okay 